inside of Excel, you can use uh, shapes to enhance the graphics inside over here. So in order to do that, you can simply go into the insert menu right here and you can see that you have an option to insert shapes right here. So you can uh, insert shapes, icons and even 3D models. So that's what we're going to talk about in further lessons uh, out there. So if we go to shapes right here, you can see that there are a lot of uh, shapes that we can choose from. Let's say, for example, I can choose something like a heart and click and drop. So you can see that now a shape is there. So I can choose the design of the shape uh, from the drop down menu on the format tab right here, according to what I want. And I can even type on the shape right here. So if I start typing while my shape is selected, you can see that the number is there. So you can change the fill color of the shape just like this. You can fill the outline color of the shape and even increase the weight of the outline of the shape right here. You can choose the type of the outline you want. So you can have dashes or straight or so forth just like this. Uh, you can also change the color of the outline right here. You can also add an effects to the shape according to what you want. For example, you want to add in, uh, let's say, a shadow or something like this. Then you can do that as well. You can have a bubble effect and so forth. So you can see that you got a 3D like shape effect right here now. So uh, what you can also do is you can go to text fill. As you can see, you can change the text color right here and even add in the text outline just like this. So you can have the text outline over here just like this. And there you go. So that is how you can do uh, make a shape right here. So simply go to insert, choose any shape you want, and then just click and drag and then make the changes uh, that is actually suitable for you. What you can also do is you can go into shape effects right here and go for various 3D effects as you can see right here. So that is how you can work with shapes inside of Microsoft Excel. Hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.